Welcome back to our casual playthrough of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. This is Jekka Rasa with Game & Gamers. And uh, we are still here in the depths. We're going to see if we can get to a light route. Um, it's over here, so let's see how we can get there. There's got to be other ones in here somewhere, I would think. But, well, let's go for this for now, at least. I wonder what this one was. I don't remember anymore what these are. I mean, this one's obviously a, uh, whatchamacallit, a uh, flux construct. Anyways, let's go get this. I'm wondering if it's a pie. Yeah, it's a pie. Darn it. Okay. So. Any place to really stand to get that? Hmm. It's not a terrible climb, I guess. This thing would be easier if I could just ascend up it, but that doesn't look like it's happening. Do this then. Get ourselves a little bit of help. Should be able to climb out on this one here a little bit, I think. Yeah, there's a thing there. Oh, <laughs> there's a bunch of stuff here. from before? Probably. No, let's just head up this way. will brighten this up. That wasn't as bad of a climb as I thought it would be, honestly. Okay, this is an interesting place, but yeah, here's the, the Yiga. Huh. Um, I do not see me. Harder for you to see me, well, to hear me. Oh boy. Um. So you can see me. No. Okay. Oh, hey. Oh, come on. <laughs> no. 
That kind of sucks. There we go. Okay. Oh, hi, plane. Right over my head. Can't seem to see me. Just need to find a way in. <laughs> uh, wrong one. <laughs> oh, fire was right there. I just go get that first. We'll figure something else out. It's just straight up. Interesting. It's unusual that it's so close. Hey, my astro's back. Nice. Alright. But I'm not sure if I mentioned this, but uh, a couple episodes when I went off camera to get uh, arrows, I uh, also had a uh, blood moon happen, so everything's back. Um, okay, oh, and my sword. And let's see. Can this last one of these? Sure. Or actually, I'll use this. This looks cool. Oh. Okay. Oh, this has a little. This is the only way in, I bet. That's interesting. Okay, let's do this. Maybe. Can I get close enough? There we go. So I gotta go down one. Okay, now I can climb this. Yeah. This might be what they give us this time, I bet. Some sort of scaffolding. Is that. Yeah, I was wondering how it was on the rock. It's put in there with the, with the stake. That's cool. All right, let's grab this first. Got enough for another two energy wells if we want it. What's this? It's probably that scaffolding. Yeah, nice. It's actually pretty cool. Instant scaffold. All right, what else is in here? Anything important? I'm actually pretty amazed at myself that I actually got that. <laughs> Here's some scaffolding here. And a ladder. Okay. Well. Oh, come on. Didn't want to do that. What a jump. <laughs> All right, we have some pose. Let's take a look where we're at. Get rid of this, and then oh, there's something over here. I'm not sure what that is, but there's something. 
Some over here too. This might be a mine, maybe. It's a little different. Oh, it might be one of those things that goes up to the sky or to the surface. Not sure. Um, what's this thing? That looks like another eagle one. I don't know if I beat that one. That's the thing. I've been marking the eagle ones to indicate I've beat them. I know uh, Jack Wilger will mark certain things with a cooking pot to say that he's beaten them. And I might want to start doing that, but it seems to be a bit late for me to start doing that. <laughs> I'd have to go through and double check everything, which would be not fun. Anyways, I think the easiest thing right now would be to head this way. There's this big open space right here, which might be a frox. And then there's something over here. See, let's head that way. So just, uh, I don't know. Monster community of some sort. Get this over here first, just more as a reconnaissance area than anything else. Okay, we got some of those. Tooling out of the way. Can't see. All right. There's more bad guys, what? Over there. Hey dudes. was on a timer. I should have guessed it, but I did not know that. I thought it was more of a you pick it up and you throw it, it lands. That explains the the quick one I had a few episodes ago. Dude, just hit him, you know, though. Come on. Hit him. Thank you. over here. Oh, this one. Oh. Okay, nice. Alright, so what do we got over there? Got a monster place. We are in this area that I was thinking should have been some sort of frocks or something, but 
Not seeing anything. Super low on those. It's only there. Either way, doesn't really matter, it looks like. Don't really want to face these guys. Yes, they give me one electric key, or maybe two electric keys, eyeballs. It's not worth it. Okay. Let's keep going. And let's climb. Not really know where we're supposed to be going. That's fine. As long as we get up top, then we're going to be good. kind of doing that just hoping that it would work and not really thinking it would but I'll take it. <laughs> that was close. Okay. No, nope, not that one. Come on. Alright, I gotta go that way. South. Let's follow this thing for a little bit. Oh, there's light loot. Okay. If I know anything, I know it's not a good idea to face major monsters without some light. So, well, you know what? I'm going to get the light loot first. Let's not worry about it. That. Wow, what is this? Okay. I don't even have that one marked. Interesting, okay. Oh, there's a bunch of trees between us. Oh, why don't I have that one marked? I guess I just forgot. Well, anything else around here? No, not really. Okay. Um, that's a ways away. And this is on the edge of the light, so maybe it's fine. What are you? It's the Gibdo Queen. That's one of those surface things. Uh, 
That won't help me against the good queen, but let's go through here. Let's get this thing first. Not that it lights anything up before me, but at least. At least we'll see where it comes up. I mean, it should be obvious since it's right underneath a certain section of the, of the map, the surface map. But well, let's try it. That takes a pretty long time. Oh. There's even a little gazebo thingy here. Is that pen? Interesting. Well, not right now, but we might come back to that. I might want to talk to Pen there. Where is that again? Washa's Bluff. And this little kind of Mickey Mouse looking thing if you turn your head sideways. Okay. Well. How can I best prepare for this thing? Any armor that's good? I mean, basically just my strongest armor, but do I want to go offensive or defensive? I mean, that kind of takes away my 12-12. That kind of sucks. Um... Let's see. Maybe I'll put something on because I don't really care about the gloom when I'm fighting them. But maybe I will do a good uh, helmet here. Yeah, sure. It doesn't matter. It's a 12. Okay. Are there any good vices I can build? Probably not. Okay, I don't know if I've ever fought this this thing down in the depths. There wouldn't be any sunlight here. So that would stink. This is going to really suck. Need you, I need you. Ow. Oh yeah, forgot about that part. Okay, read you. Dude, read you, where are you? There you are. Okay. Okay, we're gone. Read you. Okay. 
Okay, what are you gonna do? No! We do. Oh, come on. There. Okay. All done with those. Got myself on that one. Thank you. Missed that one. Oh, come on. I feel like this is a bad idea. Yes. Okay, that one's dead. No. Come on. Missed. Oh wait, there's another one? What? I thought I got all of them. Okay. Um, pause everything. Where are you, Riju? Okay. I should probably be wearing my lightning helm, but I don't care. Ow. Okay. This requires food. Dude, these are way worse. This battle is way worse than it is up top. Okay. All right, now, now I can actually do stuff. You know what? You're annoying. So much easier up in the sky, or up on the surface, I mean. Not in the depths. <laughs> that sun really makes a difference. Hey. We got a little Gibdo wing. Do I want it? It turns. Dude, I don't want this. It turns things into gusters. Do I want a guster? You know what? I really don't. I don't use gusters at all. Some people really like guster type weapons. I do not. <laughs> Alright. There we go. 358. Now, where are we? <laughs> okay, we can go up to this now. Let's head that way. There. 
I wonder if there's a preferred way to beat that thing in the depths. Because what I was doing sure wasn't that fun. If you guys know any better way to beat that thing down here in the depths, um, go ahead and let me know in the comments. Because <laughs> next time I face it, I could definitely use some help. Oh. Oh, it's a good thing I had my attack up stuff on. Because or else that would have been even worse. Um, so, oh, that's why I got it sorted wrong. <laughs> I mean, it was sorted right for what I needed it earlier. I don't think I need the climbing gear for this. These are small, small climbs until you reach a ledge, so it's not a big deal. Oh, missed the puff shrimp. Oh well. Um, stop. Okay. What will I find up here? In the middle of nowhere. Okay, well, that did not. Let's go look at this one. Is this the one I looked at earlier, or is it completely different? Soldier Spring, that's the same one. Okay. Alright, let's head over here, see what we can find as far as what's going on everywhere. Down to 20 of these with that 19. Oh dude, that didn't help me at all. I already had one there. Okay. Um which one important over here. Yeah, not that I can see. Now it goes up to a huge mountain area here since that's a ca uh, chasm. Okay, well, let's just head to that thing then. Okay, let's get this over here. Sledge. Give us a bit of height advantage. And we're going down into stuff. Not you. What is this random thing doing here? Is this indicative of another enemy? Not that I can tell. Okay, just some random thing there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, let's go back this way then. I was thinking maybe there was. Uh, I mean, it wasn't a big enough outcropping for the frogs, but I was thinking maybe it indicated like talus or something. Okay. Okay, you scared me. You're easy to beat, but you scared me. <laughs> Just jumping out of nowhere like that. Oh, there's a thing here, nice. What is this? Something blinked or shimmered or whatever it was. Okay. Okay, so we got this. You. Let's refresh your things. Come on. What the heck? Come on. There we go. Okay. 
from you. Yeah. I have probably just enemies I don't want to face. Yeah, you look easy, but I don't really want to face you. Let's go this way. Go around the enemies. We grab some puff shrooms. Yes, yes. Okay, it's just that. Okay, good. I thought it was going to fall off because it was, I was hanging from it, basically. Okay. Siku Rukum Lake. Is this exploring? Yep, it expands everything. Good. Let's see what we got in this area that we can go find. Oh, nice. I like that. <laughs> okay. Let's get rid of that. Um, okay, this looks like a mine over here. And that could be a mine or a Yiga. It looks more, maybe more like a Yiga encampment. We need a couple supply depots. Okay, so nothing major. Um, I don't see any anything around here as far as light units go. Yeah, I mean, I would think there'd be something over here, but maybe not. I don't know. I guess we'll see. Um, I say let's head to the mine first. That way. It's down there. I can see it. Rome Canyon Mine. Get the treasure first, since they always have treasure. Yep. What do we got? Oh, just charge. Okay. Speaking of the charge, let's get this zone I charge. Okay. Um, I don't want this. It's even worth it getting this zonite here. I mean, there's some large zonite, so that's that's always good. Okay. Um. Need big deposits. Model bud. So drumming well. Okay. Um. Oh. Oh. Probably could have jumped out of that faster. Or climbed out of it faster. Oh, of course. And I should have. <laughs> Okay, um, let's see, there's the Yiga base, that's kind of obvious, let's go that way, This episode. Not my favorite thing to do, but when it's necessary, I do it. Interesting. But I came this way. Oh, it works. 
one. That wasn't good. You know what? That doesn't work. There we go. see what we can get to. There's no platform there, but it doesn't look like it's going to help me at all. Okay. That's enough of that. Let's get some climbing gear. Where am I climbing gear? There it is. At this point in the game, I should know where all my gear is, right? <laughs> all right. Doesn't look like there's any. If there are any places that I can actually rest here, this is the closest one, and it doesn't work. So I should be good getting up here, though. So here's where I need to be. Let's switch back. I need to find the dude I need to kill. Oh, there's things here. Okay. Where you at, dude? Oh, there you are. Turn you off. <laughs> okay, I wonder what schematic this is. If it's that thing, I, I really hope it's not that thing. It does, but that thing looked worthless. Uh, dude, I didn't even press A. I didn't know you could just get on them from t up top or something. Interesting. Okay. Large Crucialis charge. I'm always too short. 398 instead of 400. Come on. Okay. Yiga schematic is flamethrower balloon. That seems worthless. Like looks like it spins around on the bottom, shooting flames. I assume it's not for transportation, it's probably for fighting enemies or something, but honestly, that just seems worthless. Okay, where am I at? I'm right here on the edge. Dude, didn't break? That's pretty awesome. Let's break it on these over here then. Yep, there it goes. Okay. Um. I don't want to use a Goma Hammer just yet. Let's use this one. Hey, got a giant bread balloon. That's good. That was so worth it. Okay, there's another thing there. Um, anything above me? No. Okay. Alright, let's go for that. Uh, that's a ways out there. Wow, maybe not. Okay, yeah, that's middle of nowhere. Oops. Well, is there anything better? No, that's the closest thing. Okay. Well, let's go get it then. We've got... Well, actually, this is the... This is basically the end of our episode, so... Um, oh wait, no. We got a couple more minutes. Yeah. Got a couple more minutes, let's go for it. We'll see how far we can get. 
Okay, we might actually make it pretty close. It looked pretty far away on the map, that was because I was zoomed in. This doesn't seem to be too bad. Alright, let's move off to the side here. Talk to this probably eager person. Oh, hi, researcher. Oops. <laughs> That's a little even for you. <laughs> I don't think it matters what I say. They're still going to try and attack me if I'm not in my eager thing. Bye. Okay. I'll get this light route and then we'll look around because this looks like a prime area. Okay, good, just gonna drop offs. Looks like a prime area for uh, some foxes and stuff like that because it looks pretty flat around here. I could be completely wrong and it just looks like that because it's dark, but <laughs> we will see. Okay. All right, so we came from here. We already did this down here. This one, I don't know what this is. Let's get rid of this. Yeah, I don't know what that is, so we gotta go back to that. Other than that, there's just a bunch of supply depots. This area over here could definitely be a frox. Let's get any area in here. This has a little bit of stuff in it, so maybe not. Alright, let's head back this way to whatever that thing is. Oh wait, is that where I came from? Yeah, that's where I came from. So what is that? Well, whatever. Okay. What is this thing? Why? Why is this thing here? Okay. Nothing here. Let's see anything important around here. There's those guys down there. I think maybe I'll just go for that treasure. Yeah, let's just go for the treasure. So let's go ahead and go back to this light route. And I think at this point we'll call it a day. Um, once we're at the light route. Um, next episode we'll go find that treasure and uh, see what else we can do. Uh, let's see, we'll go that way, right? Yeah. Who knows, maybe we'll run into some frogs or something else going that way too. That would be pretty cool because we need more frogs to up this uh, to its uh, second level. The, uh, whatchamacallit, the hat I think is the one that's short? Yeah, the hat is short one. So if we can just get another frogs fang, a regular frogs fang, then that would get us up to the second level on that and then figure out what the, uh, the bonus is for the set. If it, there is one, I, th I assume there is one, and I've heard there is one. But you never know. Okay, well, thanks for watching, and you guys have a great day.